fourth play finish is, you know, not this thing that. Yeah, absolutely. You know, Me Mega still played extremely well all the way through the tournament. Uh, I always enjoy seeing Mega. I, I always uh, keep an eye on all the Ikes in the game, and they and uh, really just uh, one of the one of the premier uh, examples of how to properly play neutral and solid punish game. Uh, but gonna go down to Slam, who's got to face Josh now in a very different style matchup in a character who can deal with Min Min much easier than I can. Mm. Wow. Um, is this? Was this the second time that we saw this matchup in here? No. Well, um, I'm pretty right. sure uh, that uh, Josh had to play against one of the Min Mins uh, earlier. Let me pull that back up while we're looking at this right now. Actually, yeah, okay, so Josh had to play against... No, actually, no, this is the first time that okay. uh, Josh has had to run to it. It was Tilde who had to go through the gauntlet of uh, putting the Min Mins into Oh, yeah, yeah. No, okay, that's not good. yeah. Um, this is, this is going to be fun. I feel like this is, this is definitely just going to be a... Uh... Uh, yeah, this, game mode. it's like a, it's gonna be a full play. We're gonna keep them on separate Yeah, it's crazy because literally everything we just said about the struggles of Ike, it completely goes onto it, it goes to the Min Min now because Min Min it, it falls into the same category except a bit further out. You got the jump nares and you have the commitments of the of the four you know the giant forward smash attacks and and um, the forward airs, but. You still, if you commit to that too much, you get hit by exactly that, the gyro, you got lasers, and Rob can absolutely tear you up if you decide to commit too hard because he's got way better frame data you up close outside of that right there, the up smash. So it's going to be interesting to see how Slam does it. I'm unfortunately going to call that this is, this set is probably going to be a very long one unless we get good frame trap option coverage like that, excuse me, not frame trap, option coverage like that from the ledge from Josh. Yeah, and uh, I'm I'm really uh, excited to see how. Wow, well, and that was just... okay. Yeah, that quick happened. answer from oh. Slam, <laughs> wasting no time at all. Oh, you're dead. You're dead. <laughs> even even if the KO didn't happen right there, you weren't recovering from that situation, and, and that's just what Rob could do to you. Oh my God, where are you going? Looking for the yeah. early recovery? I like. <laughs> yeah, just you, you're hitting Rob with that. Rob has ten thousand years to stay out there. This is something I was gonna ask about. I was wondering like how um, he was gonna recover against Bob, mm -hmm. and uh, I feel like we're already seeing the answer. Yeah, like this is just it, it's one of those matchups that Min Min cannot afford to ever get caught off stage because Slam just went right at him and decided to take him out. That was so good. I see that's exactly what we were talking about. Obviously, much easier done by Rob, but it, it's those situations that put fear into people because the last two times that Slam had to recover, it was low recovery onslaught, destroying in everything. That time. Okay, all right, cool. I'm up a whole stock at 0%. I have no negative factors here to going right at you at your high recovery and punishing you for it. Josh just absolutely tore that game up. Um, and I think 100% will probably... Actually, I don't even know what kind of stage counter pick switch we see because both of these characters love the same exact stages. Bro, he just flew up into the sky and hit him. <laughs> that was that that was <laughs> just like <laughs> it, it's funny because uh that was the same thing that slam did to ike literally mm -hmm. the last set yep flew, flew up and hit him out of the air yep. and that's exactly what rob did to min min it's the same thing man the elon musk new space program going out there tearing apart min min like that was just, that, that was so rough because in that situation right it, you, you, for one, you already committed to a forward air at the high end of the stage, which I don't know what that was for, but um, you're pretty much stuck between, oh, I got to react quickly and jump, or I have to react quickly and air dodge down uh, and hope I don't get caught, because if you air dodge too low or you, you accidentally do some kind of mistake, Rob can just dip back down and also just get back to stage without getting punished. So uh, we're actually going to see a switch over to Kalos. Um, I can agree with this. Uh, uh, like, I don't 100% agree with it, but I can agree with this, mostly because of the fact that you have the wider blast zones in order to stay alive a bit longer uh, from those side B janks. And that, that, actually, that's about it. Uh, <laughs> uh, in the platforms, so you can have a little bit of a difference of uh, consistency to recover, because we saw last game, like, Josh just tore the recovery apart. You need a few different routes that you can take. Yeah, and and I, and I can definitely see it from the point of view where um, in this matchup, Rob is gonna be the character that's 
uh, more boxing heavy, and then it's going to be the one that's keeping away from him. And you can see already that Slam Jam is, is not, does not want to interact with this character at all. Yeah, I actually like what Slam did in that last knock too. Got a hold of the gyro and used it to fully tech chase follow up with a forward smash from Megawatt. Like, that was crazy. Something we don't see too often in this matchup too. Uh, good job getting that, uh, getting that down throw KO. Uh, we haven't seen too much of exactly what we're seeing now, <laughs> the Ram Ram. Uh, it was mostly Megawatt, but the Ram Rams finally come into play at low percents to try and uh, get some quick damage in. Yeah, and uh, yeah, and, and uh, right now, uh, wow, we actually just saw Josh then get in probably for the first time in this uh, game too. And this is already looked like Slam is in survival mode right now. And, yeah. Uh, like what? what trying what, to mash up the corner. What's your get off me option in that point? You have up smash, and that, that's pretty much it. And mashing up smash, uh, I you know, in that situation where all those down tilts are happening, it can get predictable. But good job from Slam. I like that using the platform to be able to go after that high recovery. Didn't even think about that when this when we came here. Uh, because it gives a little bit more room to cover that high recovery attempts from Josh. A nice delay, not getting hit by that down air. Does not matter though. Josh is gonna cover with the side B. Yeah, it didn't delay enough to get hit by that uh, that side B. And let's see how Rob's gonna recover in this situation. Yeah, and yeah, and you know what I'm surprised that actually is that I'm not. We're not seeing a lot of the ram ram, right? And I feel like mm -hmm. if if you're gonna try to edge guard Rob or try to mess with his recovery, ram ram would, would be the option. Oh, there we go though the dragon shot's gonna do it i think i think the reason why we're seeing so little ram ram uh is just because it's like the amount of times that uh slam has to commit to get in it, it, it's hard because of the fact that you're basically committing to jumping in against rob uh, i do like this air to air game we're seeing now though like with the ram ram because it's a f it's faster frame data so you're gonna beat out rob's nair but now with the megawatt you get a lot more out of the few times that you're gonna box with them, no. except for when you get called no. out on anti airs like that. You, what are you doing? Oh my god! And then oh, I like that. I thought we were gonna see this uh, the side B, but instead going for the down tilt and catching the quick jump off with the down smash, and that could probably be another KO right there. Uh, no oh, good yeah. TI from Slam, but oh, stop down, down airing. Down airing. <laughs> down airing <laughs> one too many times. It only works once a few times. You can't do it too much. <laughs> Yo, my man went to full survival. Mode. He said, I need to get out as soon as possible. <laughs> I, I need out of this house right right now and not having it at all. Like, that, like good DI and then just deciding to down air so fast when you're at KO percent against the Rob in full center stage. Like, I, I, I know it's stressful. You, it's, like, you wanna, usually want to dip off to the sides, but down airing after he's caught you two other times with that up tilt, kind of ill-advised. So <laughs> that, that worked out really well for Josh when... That game, honestly, I, I was ready to put that one in the, in the books for Slam because off the rip, even after losing the stocks, Slam looked really, really good in that game too. Uh, but Josh was just able to shut it down. My man was in shambles. I don't know what happened. Like, I, I I, it, it's like he got put in the air once and he was just like, okay, I, he, he blue screen. Honestly, um, I know it, it, it can be a rough situation to be put in, mm -hmm. but uh, oof, like three downers, that was some DSS. That was some like, that was like some 20 Smash 4 ZSS stuff. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> honestly, like, look, Z ZSS has always had the blessed down there to be able to get out of uh, situations. And it, it, it is one of your better landing options for what? <laughs> I, I, all right, all right, all right, look, I all right, look. It. I love uh, it. Yo, Wi-Fi yo, Ganon is like OG. Okay, look, yeah, it, yes, Wi-Fi Ganon goes up like a whole, a whole ass tier just from existing in the fact that people can't react as easy to the interactions. However, this is still Rob versus Ganon. <laughs> <laughs> so basically, here's what's gonna happen: either Slam wins in three interactions, or he gets destroyed in every other regard. Like that's oh all God. you got. <laughs> I, I messed with the vision. I'm not gonna lie. I messed with guest list. Okay, 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 okay. I mean, I'm with it. I, I love watching Ganon. I 100%. But this exact that right there, you have no good out of shield options, nor do you have great boxing options against Rob. So you need to constantly call out bad jumps and be, bad defense. I'll be right back. Sorry. I got you. Got you. But still, though, like <laughs> everything about this is rough. Pretty much, you're just look like you're looking for those early KOs, trying to read the jump, and it was a little bit late on the call. Uh, honestly, I don't know like it, it, what you do in this situation here though. When you're when you're forced into the corner, and like, 
<laughs> Never mind. I'm gonna shut up. I'm gonna shut, just jump up. And that's a dead stock. Good job from Josh catching the the miss tech. And now you're in exactly where you don't want to be. Behind in percent and stocks against Rob uh, as Ganon. You're pretty much. It, 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 it's the worst possible place because now Ganon gets to just chill. Excuse me. Rob gets to just chill. Play back. Uh, and just not commit to anything where Ganon always has to uh, force that approach. What's the call here? Just like you see it right now. Just, <laughs> oh my god. I am a huge fan of slams. Just consistent. <laughs> like, what's that? Three for three on the, on the chokes? You usually see people miss that. Slam's not missing any of them so far. Uh, but still, and here it is finally. Eventually, that's going to get called out. Okay, I'm back. Sorry. Uh, <laughs> welcome back. Slam was able to get a stock, but it's right back to uh, business as usual, where it's just rough. Yeah, you. Oh, actually, not dropping down with the down air. Now that uh, now it's getting called out consistently. Those chokes were working a few times, but the jumps. Yeah. So, so the thing about Ganon is that um, his large, he has the best ledge hang in the game. So even if he throws, even if he throws gyro like that, mm -hmm. um, the gyro won't hit him. Let the ball go. True, true, true. I completely, I completely forgot about that. Um, yeah, it 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 will actually never hit. Him. He's not in danger. Oh, you know what? I'm I that was that was really really good idea from Slam. Not only trying to cover the low recovery, but looking for the up B to try and catch a high recovery. This is actually even all of a sudden because that is a hundred percent. Yeah, now a hundred percent for sure. Uh, like this is full KO percent for Josh. And Josh got to be careful now. Okay, yeah. Um, one thing we're gonna watch out for is up the other shield. Up the other shield is actually. Oh, that sucks because Slam actually had the right call. Slam like called out that roll away with the uh, with the wizard's foot, but was just a little bit out of position and a hair too late because of the clank with the like the gyro kind of caused an early getup. Uh, either way, I gotta give it to Slam. Whether win or lose, the fact that Slam has been able to keep it even so far in this matchup, which is very hard to consistently zone break in. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I thought I was smashing one bit. Oh no. He uses the eye, yeah. Don't, don't wish kick, please. Don't down me. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! Okay, 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 okay. <laughs> All right. Oh, I'm this gonna is do the frame one. by frame on that. You gotta one. make the right call. Gets out of what? it. What? Bro, what? Oh Yo, no. Yo, Josh, Josh can do I mean, Slam, Slam can do this. Like, Slam, all right, never mind, not anymore. Bro, not anymore. It's care. over, it's over. Yo, I, no, look, 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 look. I don't care. I don't even care what stuck to, for the fact that he went that low reverse up because he didn't get that he died. Yeah, that oh like, yeah, true, true, true. I didn't even think about that. Like not only going, going nothing. down to go get that was one thing, but the commitment of literally, all right, I lose if I, if I don't get this. Like, what, what, what a pair, <laughs> but you know what, Slam, great job. Uh, just going through the bracket, getting all the way to losers finals, uh, ended up losing in the end, uh, to Josh in what is a long. very, very difficult matchup for, uh, Min Min by comparison to other characters, but then switching to the Ganon and still keeping it pretty close. That was entertaining. That was beautiful. Um, that was beautiful. We, we need to, we need to protect that second stock, that second stock by Josh. I mean, not my Josh, excuse me, Slime Jam because. Yes. Yeah, that, that, that's, a, that's an eternal one. See, that's that situation right there because you saw that um, Slam was going to read the roll, but because of how quick the bounce came from the gyro uh, on, on the tech, uh, excuse me, on the missed tech, it actually screwed it up. So Slam actually could have been in the lead there and instead ended up losing the stock. So that actually might have played a big difference in this game just from that. But yeah, right here, um, oh my god, look at this. Like, just the commitment. Like, wild. where that's do you wild. think that's you wild. are going? <laughs> Almost, I want like fan art drawn of that. <laughs> like, that was so good. Oh my god. I love I love when people do that. Like, it's just, it, it's, it's heavy risk, but like, who's expecting that? 